Audiences are amazed at Brandon Stiles' live performances. He's like a song chameleon in his variety show. When he changes the channel on the radio, he seems to channel a different artist. Even in costume as Ozzy Osbourne, it's only a matter of several seconds before he transforms to Mick Jagger. It's a wild one hour ride for people in the audience who are mesmerized by this master of musical impressions. Brandon Stiles has been performing since he was in elementary school in Grand Rapids, Michigan. I was, I, oh man, I was a comical kid. Um, facial expressions, always trying to, yeah, class clown kind of thing growing up in school. Um, I always was impersonating somebody, trying to be, you know, all these different types of people. And uh, when I seen Michael Jackson, and my mom and dad told me what he did in 1982 when he hit Billie Jean, um, it was just really, really cool. And I was like, I need to dance. I want to sing. I want to do all that stuff. And uh, yeah, so we were sewing costumes and my family gave me just a whole bunch of support. And I was doing talent shows and yeah, signing little autographs when I was in third grade and I took it really serious. Magic illusions are also part of the variety show. He started doing magic tricks as a child. Yeah, and the magic came in around seven years old as well, a magic kit. Um, and my uncle back palmed a potato. It was the first trick that was ever done to me. He back palmed a, a potato and pulled it out of my ear. I understand a coin, you know, <laughs> but a whole potato blew my mind when I was super, super little. And I thought, that was too cool. I want to do that for people and make them happy. Two balls here. Styles did an impression of three American presidents right. during one Let's magic routine. Candace Long from Madison, Mississippi was picked from the audience to participate on stage. Hi, 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 my name is Bill. It's nice to meet you, Candace. You sure are pretty. Yes, you are. This is going to be amazing. All you have to do, Candace, is lay your hand up like this. This is going to be amazing. I'm going to take this ball. <laughs> What is funny about that? <laughs> I'm gonna take this ball, I'm gonna take mine and squeeze on it tight. You take this when you squeeze on it really, you got, you got it tight. All right, what's good? This is gonna be amazing. We're gonna count to three. So, and this is gonna be amazing. One, two, three. Slowly open your hand and look, my ball actually jumps inside of your hand. That was amazing. Oh my <laughs> Whatever. God. Oh my God. Yes, I did, that was amazing. I was, I was a little surprised. <laughs> I was a little shy at first, but I'll figure out what the heck. Just have fun, right? Styles' professional career began to take off right out of high school. He toured nationally for several years and got a phone call one day from an agent looking for a variety artist to work in coastal Alabama. Like many others, Styles was impressed with the quality of life in this region and the opportunity for his family. We were trying to think about how you'd put a show here and how it would even work here. Um, and I fell in love with the place, not just for the entertainment, but uh, for the lifestyle down here. I was like, wow, this is really cool. Like I could actually move my family down here and live here. I was looking at the crime rate and looking at what it was like. And I thought, this is an opportunity to get off the road. 
<laughs> I still miss the road. I love the road. But, you know, um, I love going home more and having family time. The Brandon Stiles Theater at Owa in Foley, Alabama, is home to his variety show, a magic show, and a dinner show called A Trip Down Memory Lane that features comedic impressions of music from the 50s, 60s, and 70s. When visitors enter, they walk into a magic shop. I always wanted a magic shop growing up. And uh, so, yeah, when you come right in, there's a, there's a whole magic shop with uh, pranks and gags and really cool stuff. And then you see the theater doors, and you enter through there, and it's a very intimate setting. It's 100 seats, and um, there's not a bad seat. And people like it, and uh, we have uh, concessions and things. And uh, we even have tables, because we do dinner shows in there as well. So um, we'll have the catering by Groovy Goat, one of the restaurants here. And it's just fantastic food. So we like a trip, like Trip Down Memory Lane, or, or other shows that we have that we bring in. Um, we do dinner shows, so it's really neat. During the variety show, Styles does 60 different vocal impressions, some with costume or dance enhancements, and some with magic. He even does ventriloquism during a duet with two characters. Um, yeah, I do Aaron Neville and Linda Ronstadt together in a duet, and I do ventriloquism as I'm doing it. <laughs> Styles' creative process is non-stop, and he's always thinking about new ideas to add to his shows. My, my enjoyment is working on the shows and always creating something new and trying to be the best I can be. And if anyone has any critiques, I'm always listening, and I, and I, love, I love that. You can only get better, so. Audiences can see Brandon Stiles live at his theater in Owa. 148 shows are already scheduled for 2021 with information available at brandonstyles.com. <laughs>